The ASEAN Tourism Forum concluded here in Yogyakarta, Indonesia on February the 5th. The 4 event involved all the 10 member states of ASEAN and five guest nations, including China, Japan, South Korea, Russia, and India. The 2023 Forum is under the theme of ASEAN, a journey to wonderful destination. During the Forum, ASEAN countries welcomed the return of the Chinese tourists. Resilience has become synonymous with our industry. And even for the ASEAN region, it will become stronger, particularly through the recent lifting of travel restrictions in China. We are uh, delightful that uh, Indonesia are uh, uh, on the list to welcome uh, Chinese tourists uh, alongside with other 20 countries. Actually, the uh, uh, tourism industry is one of the uh, uh, economic powerhouse for our GDP because uh, during the pandemic it's already calculated up to 3% for the GDP and we uh, do hope that it will be increased after the pandemic when the tourism recovery is uh, going on. Uh, tourism are exchanging people, people to people, contact will be the most uh, important for our economic recovery. Uh, Việt Nam luôn luôn hoan nghênh chào đón uh, khách du lịch uh, Trung Quốc đến Việt Nam. Uh, khi mà có kế hoạch uh, Trung Quốc uh, mở lại uh, du lịch ấy, thì uh, chính quyền uh, và các doanh nghiệp du lịch ấy, uh, đã sẵn sàng uh, chuẩn bị các cái sản phẩm du lịch tốt nhất để phục vụ đón tiếp phục vụ khách du lịch Trung Quốc. Việt Nam welcome Chinese uh, tourists to Việt Nam. The event is also expected to establish partnerships in the fields of marketing, investment, and human resources. Established in 1981, the Asian Tourism Forum aims to promote the Asian region as one tourist destination.